guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you can already tell by the title, this is going to be a $5 and under tutorial. I'm really excited to introduce this to my channel just because I haven't done anything like this. And I've been wanting to do this for so long and I've been putting it off, putting it off, putting it off. But today is the day that I do my $5 and under series that I introduced my $5 and under series. So basically, as you can tell, it's pretty self-explanatory. I'm just going to be bringing you a specific type of product that you can find for $5 and under. Obviously, the ones that I think, or that in my opinion, are the best quality for the amount of price that you're paying for the product. I am really excited to do this just because, like I said, it's very long overdue in my book. I've been wanting to do this for so long, and I've been putting it off and putting it off, and I haven't gotten around to it. But today is the day that we do that, and I'm super stoked. Stoked? I never say stoked. I don't know where that came from. I don't know. And we are going to be doing that today. Um, for my next video, I might do blushes. It might be lipsticks. I don't know. Whatever you guys want me to do, I will do. Basically, I just wanted to introduce this because at the end of the day, we all love high end. But we can't all afford it, and that's just a sad truth. Not everybody can splurge $25, $35, $45, $50 dollars on one single makeup product. And that's just the reality of life. People have bills. People have life going on. People have children. People have things to pay. And not everybody has money to be spending on one single makeup product. Now, at the end of the day, a makeup product is not a priority for a lot of people. However, a lot of us want good quality. And we might not want to pay the price that you have to pay to get good quality. And that is what I'm here for. To give you guys this video. <laughs> so basically, I have pretty much done my research. And I have scavenged, I have tested, and I have brought you today a series of lip liners that are under $5. Or they are $5 and under, whether you can find them in the drugstore, whether you can find them at Ulta, whether you can find them at Sephora, whether you have to buy them online. They are basically lip liners that you will find anywhere for $5 and under. And they are obviously products that I stand by and all products that I truly, truly love or I truly enjoy to use. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave me your request down below for what you would like to see next for my $5 and under series. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and let's get started. Okay, so the first lip liner that I'm going to be showing you guys today, it is by the brand Palladio. I am really, really surprised to mention that these products are really overlooked. Or, yeah, they're really overlooked in the YouTube community. I don't see a lot of YouTube gurus talking about these. And I'm pretty surprised that they don't because I honestly really, really love these. I came across these one day that I was at Sally's. And mind you, I don't really like to go to Sally's for whatever reason. I have one that's fairly close to me, but I don't, I don't ever really go to it. So, I popped in one day and I was like, what is this Palladio? I've never heard of it. I bought it and let me just tell you. Girl, I don't know why people don't talk about these. They are so absolutely amazing. And they are so absolutely cheap. At my Sally's, they sell for $2.99, so under $3. And let me tell you, the quality is absolutely amazing. They are super creamy. They are super blendable. And you don't have to use these as just a lip planner. I find that they really look good when you use them as an all-over lip um, product. It just looks absolutely amazing. I'm just going to keep it to one color. I do have multiple of the colors that I'm showing you, but I'm just going to keep it to one color because I don't want the video to be super, super long. And the color that I'm showing you guys today is in the shade of Raisin, a deep, deep plum purple shade with a little bit of brown in it, and it looks really pretty. If you don't have any Sally's around you, you can find them at Ulta or Ulta.com. They are also $2.99 at Ulta and these are absolutely an amazing deal. The only con that I would say and I think these are a con for pretty much all these kinds of lip liners that I'm going to mention but this is a wooden lip liner which means you have to sharpen it. It's not retractable and I personally really really enjoy when they are retractable just because it takes away that extra work that you have to do. However, there is one thing that I would say about non-retractable lip liners and that is that they do get a finer point and they do let you um, really draw on your lips a lot better than the retractable ones just because I feel like the retractable ones with with time they end up just turning into a round point instead of a fine point so that's the good thing about the wooden ones that are sharpenable you're able to get it to that crisp point 
Um, but if you don't care about that, then obviously you would like the retractable ones. They do have a retractable version of the Palladio ones, but I personally find that the regular wooden ones are much creamier and are much better quality and they are about a dollar cheaper. Check these out at your local Sally's or Ulta. If I'm looking down, it's just because I'm trying to look at the notes and I'm trying to look at the things that I had previously written so that I do not forget to mention. So, the next brand is a fairly new brand and they are pretty much all over YouTube. If you watch YouTube videos constantly, I'm pretty sure you've heard about these. And these are the ColourPop Lip Liners. These are absolutely amazing quality. Now, the only thing about these is that they don't sell them in any stores, to my knowledge. You have to buy everything from ColourPopCosmetics.com or ColourPop.com. <laughs> the hype is so beyond real. These are absolutely amazing. And it's actually the one that I'm wearing on my lips today. I don't own any more of their lip liners, but you know I'm going to stock up. The color I have it in is in the shade Lumiere. And this is actually the color that Kathleen Lights here on YouTube created. The color is really, it's, it's on point. It's like a nude plum I don't really know how to explain it but it's just an absolutely gorgeous color it's not nude and it's not too bold but it's just that perfect in-between shade these retail for five dollars which is a great deal because let me tell you you are getting quality when you buy these again they are sharpenable you don't get the retractable with these and the color variety they have like a bajillion colors on that site like so many colors it was really overbearing and really overpowering when I went on that site to purchase the lip liner I was like now you know what let me just buy this one and if I like it I'll buy more so I bought this one and I'm definitely going back and for five dollars talk about a bang for your buck because these are absolutely perfect the next lip liner that I'm gonna be talking about is another lip liner that I just feel like is not really popular or is another one that is overlooked in the YouTube community and it is in the brand Essence a buck forty nine yeah these are less than two dollars like this is just ridiculous it is so stinking cheap but these are so good like the pigmentation is so on point it's just it's just ridiculous the only thing that I will say about these is that the color variety it's not on point there's about five shades maybe four or five shades there's just no variety. When you have four or five shades of something, that's not a good thing. But the quality is great. They are super pigmented. And they just go on the lips so easily and so smoothly. And for $1.49, seriously, guys, you would be crazy not to buy this. I'm not even kidding. Like, you need to get your hands on this. And you can find these at Ulta. I bought mine from Ulta for $1.49. Absolutely amazing. The next lip liner that I'm going to be talking to you guys about is from the brand Milani. And these you can find at the drugstore. This is my first Milani lip liner. It's really, really good. But I haven't seen any more. Like every time I go to CVS or any drugstore, Walgreens, or even when I go to Walmart and things like that, like I never see any lip liners from Milani. I don't know. I, I've never ran into them. The shade that I have is in the color Pretty Pink, number 13. And these are $3.49 at Walgreens. So definitely get your hands on these wherever you can find them. I don't know if you're going to be having a hard time like me to find these. But wherever you find them, just get it and you won't regret it. Oh my god. I just rhymed. Quick warning, because I just feel like I'm going to get annoying with this. I am going to be saying the same words, whether it's creamy, whether it's blendable, whether it's smooth, whether it's perfect, whether it's amazing. These products are in this video because I feel that way about them. Honestly, I apologize in advance. But... I'm sorry if I'm using the same words over and over again. Moving on. The next lip liner that I'm going to be showing you guys is the LA Girl Endless Semi-Permanent Auto Lip Liner. This Bye Bye Right Higher is retractable and is very true to its name. These things are super, super semi-permanent. They're not permanent, but let me tell you, it almost feels like they are. These stay on my lips for so freaking long. The day that I wore it for the first time, it was probably like... 10 o'clock and around like 7 o'clock the thing was still on my lips the pigmentation guys and the staying power is just phenomenal and you can buy these at LA girl USA I believe that's the site for LA girl I will list it down below everything I will list down below because I feel like I'm sounding a little crazy as far as when I say where you can find these products but I just can't remember, so I'm going to have to list it down below. But I believe it's LA Girl USA or LA Girl Cosmetics .com. I don't know. But get this, it's $5. And the shade that I have it in is in the color 
marvelous. The next lip liner that I'm going to be showing you guys today is by NYX and it is the NYX Retractable Lip Liner. The color that I'm showing you guys today is Fruit Punch and it is a very pretty red-ish pink color. It's definitely not all the way red, it's not all the way pink, it's definitely that in-between happy bright color. These aren't as creamy as the rest but I will tell you right now the staying power makes up for it. These stay as long as the semi-permanent lip liners for me. They last that long on my lips. It's that perfect lip liner that will keep your lipstick in place because it will serve as that perfect line on the outside of your lips to just keep everything locked in there so it doesn't like smudge and get out of place. So it's just that perfect lip liner for that and again this is in the shade Fruit Punch and $4.50 at your local Ulta or Ulta.com. The next lip liner that I'm going to be showing you guys today is by Rimmel and this is the Rimmel A Thousand Kisses lip liner. These things last long. It goes on super smooth and it stays on the lips for so long. Um, absolutely amazing staying power. It's in the drugstore so you know the price is always going to be good with this. I got it for about $3.49 at Walmart but you can get this for about $3.99 at Ulta. The next lip liner that I'm going to be showing you guys, I feel like it took me a year and a half to find it. I swear to God, I looked for it everywhere because everybody was hyping it up and I'm like, oh my God, I need to find that lip liner because everybody loves it. And I believe the hype came from Carly Bible on YouTube because she loves it. So it is the Jordana lip liner in the shade Tawny. Guys. <sighs> I don't even know what I'm going to say. I own quite a few of these and I love them all. These are absolutely amazing. You can find them at Walgreens. I believe Walgreens is the only drugstore that carries Jordana products. I don't know where else you can find them, but I know you can get them at Walgreens. And they go for $2.39 at Walgreens. Definitely worth the hype. These are absolutely amazing and very, very affordable. These are retractable, which is a bonus in my book because you don't have to deal with the sharpener. If you don't have a sharpener, girl, who cares because your lip liner got your back. Hey, guys. So that pretty much sums up my $5 and under lip liner tutorial. Um, I'm pretty excited to be bringing you guys more of these just because, like I said, I think affordability does really matter. Just because I know that a lot of you guys really do appreciate products that are affordable and products that are just, you don't have to break the bank to buy them. And I just think anybody can appreciate that. I don't know when I'll be getting this video up. I hope I get it up pretty soon. I'm pretty bummed because I had filmed a few videos. They were on my um, SD cards. I put them in my computer and I was editing them. And now my computer's not turning on today. Like, I've tried everything. And the computer isn't turning on. So I'm freaking out because now I feel like my computer... The only way to save it is if I like erase everything from it and do like a factory reset and if that's what I have to do, I'm going to lose all that footage and that's going to make me very upset. So I'm sorry if this video goes up really late and I'm sorry if there's a little bit of a gap between this video and my last videos. Just know that I have been filming but I kind of encountered a big boo-boo. I think that pretty much sums up this video. Don't forget to leave me a request down below because I really want to know what you guys think about this whole video situation and I want to know what you guys want me to bring you guys next whether it's a hair tutorial or a makeup tutorial or a review or a tag anything you guys want to see from me please let me know I hope you guys enjoyed this video as always don't forget to comment like and subscribe I will catch you in my next video and thank you so much for watching bye